If you're looking for some beasts in FM24 that you can sign for a very cheap fee, then stick with us in this video because we'll be covering 15 dirt cheap bargains that you can pick up for under 2 million. Some are about 2 mil, some are about 30, 40,000 pounds. So there'll be something for everyone in this video, 15 players to get through. So let's get right into it. Now we've got players from all leagues in this video, but we're going to start with a goalkeeper playing in the Ecuadorian divisions for Independiente del Valle, who are one of the biggest sides in Ecuador and in their ranks is Moises Ramirez who is a 22 year old international cap goalkeeper and he specializes in the modern day elements of being a goalkeeper he's got amazing physical attributes for a keeper in fact arguably some of the best I've seen he's only six foot one but he's got great reflexes he's very eccentric and he makes up for his lack of height with great aerial reach his speed combined with his one-on-ones and the fact that he's got a high tendency to rush out makes him a great goalie if you're looking to play a sweeper keeper on the attack duty when it comes to the traditional things to do with goalkeeping and the distribution side of stuff he's maybe not the best but if you're looking for a goalkeeper to play high up and act as almost a sweeper behind your defense and Moises Ramirez could be the man we're moving forward into midfield for our next player looking at a talented creator called Andre Franco who you can find at FC Porto who in most saves at the age of 25 you'd assume would cost like 10 15 million but when you start your save he'll be transfer listed for 2 million and is wanted by a host of Premier League clubs and even Al Nasser out in Saudi Arabia and you can see why because he's got great attributes all around really good technique finishing ability the passing the vision the first touch the physical attributes the mentals he's got everything going for him he's versatile and can play anywhere along that front line as well as a bit deeper in midfield so if you're after a talented midfielder then this Portuguese national could be the man for you if you're looking for someone on the cheaper side though then check out Alexandra Barbosa who is an Argentinian 28 year old centre back he's valued at about 100 to 200 thousand pounds and he's playing his football for Libertad out in the Paraguayan divisions. He's an important player for his team and you can see why being six foot four with great strength, natural fitness, jumping reach and with great defending attributes as well. The heading, the tackling and the positioning combined with great marking and even ball playing attributes with nice passing, vision and technique make him a great option. For me, he's good enough to play for a low level Premier League team and for that kind of price, you really can't turn your nose up at it. Before we continue with the other 10 plus players that we've got left on this list, I'd like to ask you guys if you could show your support by smashing the like button we'd massively appreciate it here on the FM Scout channel it helps our videos because YouTube thinks well everyone's liking them they're great and they promote it to more people so that really is a big help to us and it only takes you a few seconds to do so thank you to anyone who does that subscribe to the channel if you haven't already as well and let us know down below your favorite cheat beast and if you want to see more content by myself you can check out my channel linked in the description where we do football manager rebuilds more entertainment style as opposed to informative FM content and some of these players would be great picks for some of them rebuilds Porto seem to have all the bargains in this video so far and if you send them 2 million quid you can get your hands on Zaidu Sanusi who is a Nigerian left back with international experience with great attributes really a six foot tall left back who's very quick great acceleration and pace combined with good strength and jumping reach he's got everything he needs in that physical department mentally he's got a lot going for him too the work rate is strong he's got good crossing ability he can head the ball well nice marking and passing as well he lacks a little bit in the technique and tackling areas but he's only going to cost you 2 mil and he's got great attributes in all of those other areas which makes him a great pick in my opinion and I've now put on the attribute analysis graph for those of you who are going to want to see that for the rest of the players. One of the most spoken about cheap gems of this year's FM of course is Alvaro Fidalgo. If you don't know about him you can find him at Club America and if you send him a million quid you can get a Spanish midfielder heading into his prime at the age of 26 with insane attributes. 17 passing, 17 vision, great technique as well, the finishing, the first touch, great mental attributes and physicals with some nice players traits as well he's versatile can play multiple areas of the pitch and he's only going to cost you one mil he's an absolute bargain of the truest sense and is definitely one of the best in this list when you start your save Al Halal will have this player transfer listed his name is Michael and he's a Brazilian 27 year old number 96 for the Saudi Arabian team transfer listed here for 1.9 million now the five foot five winger is definitely worth going for at that fee because you get someone who is perfect for this year's match engine he's fast with great agility and acceleration combined with some nice flair as well and some great technical attributes with nice technique vision he can pass well and he can finish at a high level too yes he's not going to be a world-class winger but again I think this is someone that could easily be Premier League quality maybe for a lower down Premier League club so he's definitely worth the pickup for only 1.9 mil might ask for a decent bit in the wages considering he is getting 40 grand a week at Al Halal but it's maybe not the worst transfer you could make in your save still over half a list to go here and this player is a brilliant one that I've signed in pre 
previous versions of Football Manager. It's Taboo Mokena. He's a South African midfielder playing his football for Melody Sundowns in the South African division. And he's only going to cost you about 500 grand for a midfielder with great ability right from the off. He's never going to be world class in any particular area, but he can go forward as well as defend at a high level. He's got 14 passing, nice vision and great technique combined with a defensive element with the positioning, the off the ball work, the tackling as well. He can hit a long shot. He's got good first touch and nice work rate. Not the strongest in your midfield though, so you might want to pair him with a stronger profile of player. But if you're looking for someone nimble in that midfield to create chances for your team and also put a foot in when needed, then Mokena could be a great pickup. This is one of my favorite picks in this whole list though, and you can see why a Premier League side like Brentford would be interested in a player like this. His name is Jaman Baratame, and I don't think I've pronounced that right, but you can find him playing for CF Monterrey in the Mexican divisions and a 24 year old former under 17 international for Argentina. He's a great talent who you can pick up for a million quid with physical attributes that are very nicely spread. He's fairly quick as well as being quite strong. Mental attributes that are really nicely balanced, but then you combine that with a 16 finishing, great dribbling. He can pass as well, nice technique, good heading ability. He can also hit a penalty should you want him to, and you can see why complete forward, one of the most specialized roles in all of Football Manager, is being suggested for him because he can create chances for his teammates as well as score goals for himself. And to get him for such a cheap fee, it's a no-brainer. And if you don't buy him fast, then Brentford will before you know it. Our next player is our second and final goalkeeper in this list. It's Naljilko Labrovic, who plays his football for Rekia out in the Croatian divisions. Costing about two million quid, he is a phenomenal goalkeeping option for the price. Six foot five and a star player for his team with great physical attributes, really nice mentals, one-on-one -on -one ability, command of his area, communication and aerial reach. If you're looking for a goalkeeper that's a bit more traditional than Ramirez, who he looked at first, then Labrovic could be a great pickup. For a cheap fee, he could play at a very high level. I've signed him before in previous saves and I've never had an issue with him. So if you've got a couple million pounds spare and you need a new goalkeeper, then Labrovic could be the one for you. This player is very heavily sought after, so you'll have to act fast, but Hampus Findel is a Swedish former under-21 international, now 23 years of age, playing his football for Jew Gardens out in the Swedish divisions. Now he's wanted here by three of the biggest Serie A sides, Juventus, Inter Milan, and also AC Milan. And you can see why they would want him. He likes to dictate tempo with great passing vision and technique. His first touch is there. He's got brilliant mental attributes for a 23 year old and the physicals are also very good. He's never going to start for any of those three clubs straight away, but he'll easily be a squad player who could grow into something a lot better than what we're seeing here. And for 1 million, he's definitely worth the punt. Five players to go. And our next one is a centre-back. It's 27-year-old Paraguayan Juan Escobar, who is playing his football for Cruz Azul out in the Mexican divisions. He's a 5'10 defender, which is going to put a lot of people off straight away. But if you can look past that, he's got decent physicals, but really it's his mentals where he fries with 16 positioning, 15 teamwork. He's got 14 tackling in the technicals as well, 14 marking, heading abilities there, the first touch. He can pass with nice technique as well. A modern day ball playing defender. Yes, he is a little bit on the smaller side, but he's got decent jumping reach, can head the ball well. So it might not be as big as a problem as you might think. And if you play him in a back three, that is going to suit him down to the ground. And I did forget to mention, you can pick him up for about 150k, which is a great deal for this kind of player. Even cheaper than that though, is Carlos Rotundi, an Argentinian 26 year old, also playing for Cruz Azul, who you can pick up for about 30 or 40,000 pounds based on his valuation here. Now he is by no means a world-class winger. I also don't think he's going to be good enough for say the Premier League, but if you're looking at a second division side, the championship, if we use the English divisions as an example, I think he could slot in there with decent physical attributes at six foot, nice balance of mentals and technicals as well. Not stand out in any area, but for that kind of price, to be a regular starter for one of the biggest sides in Mexico, he's definitely worth that money. And even if he doesn't turn out very good for you, you'll still make, you know, 10 times the profit when you eventually go to sell him. Another Club America gem that's quite well known in this year's FM game is Alejandro Zendejas, who you can pick up for a very cheap fee of about about 15,000 pounds. He's got great ability in so many areas. He's an American international who's balanced across the technicals, the physicals and the mentals. He's only five foot five. So again, you might want a stronger profile alongside him, but he's versatile with great attributes. And at that price, you just have to buy him. He is a complete no brainer. Our penultimate player is also playing in the Mexican divisions for Zolas Tijuana. And this is Lucas Rodriguez, a left sided winger who can also play as a number 10, former under 20 international for Argentina. He's now 20 26, an important player and again one of the larger sides in Mexico with great ability all around he really does shine in his technicals with 14 finishing 14 first touch passing
passing and technique of the exact same level and great dribbling ability as well. He's going to beat his man. He's going to take a shot. He's going to cross. He's going to pass. He can create chances in all kind of ways. And for about 2 million quid, he is an absolute bargain. And finally, if you're after a physically gifted midfielder, then check out 25-year-old Gaius Makuta. He's got 16 appearances for the Congo national team and is playing his football for Boa Vista out in Portugal with only one year left on his deal. So he could be worth scouting and maybe picking up on a free should he not extend that deal at his club. And you can see exactly why I love this kind of player. Physically, he is absolutely phenomenal with 17 strength, 16 balance, 17 natural fitness, stamina combined with great speed and agility. A true physical beast who likes to hit a ball with power, whether it's a free kick or a long shot. It looks like he wants to just power through the middle and crack a shot off with 16 determination, good work rate, passing ability, finishing, long shots. He has got the absolute lot. A very fun player to have in your team should you pick him up. He can play defensive midfield, central midfield or attacking midfield. So he's very handy to have in your side for a cheap fee as well. He is an absolute top draw player. And there we go. That's 15 cheap beasts for you guys to check out in your saves. Let us know your favorites in the comments down below and anyone that you think we missed. If you want to see a part two to this, smash the like button. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.